Hello to everybody and welcome to my YouTube channel, Jim's 5am Club. Today is a very special day for Greeks throughout the world as it is Independence Day, Greek Independence Day. And what I would like to do today is something a little different to what I do on a normal basis. And what I'd love to do today is to read a poem entitled The Gift of Hellenism, a poem that I came across a number of years ago, but it is apt and is uh, a perfect expression of what we are celebrating today and an opportunity for us to reflect on the wonders of Hellenism. Destroy all of Greece and sink her to the depth of a hundred meters. Empty all of your museums worldwide. Destroy everything Greek around the globe. Then try and erase the Greek language from everywhere, from your medicine, from your pharmacy, from your math, including geometry and algebra, from your physics, from your chemistry, from your astronomy, from your religion, from your politics and everyday life. Delete mathematics, delete all the shapes and change the triangle to an octagon and the straight line to a curved line. Delete all geometry from your buildings, your roads, your games, your cars. Erase the name of each disease from your medication. Erase democracy, erase politics, delete gravity and bring the top down and the bottom up. Change your satellites to have a square orbit. Change your books as they will be Greek in the words, grammar, arguments and thoughts they include everywhere you look. Erase every Greek word from your everyday life. Change the Gospels. Change the Epistles. Change the Septuagint, the Old Testament. Change the Ecumenical Councils and all of the communications between the bishops for the first 1200 years of Christianity. Change the Alpha and the Omega. Change the name of Christ, as this too comes from the Greek language and means he who is anointed. Change the shape of your buildings. Change the shape of your churches. Erase the history of Alexander the Great, Homer, Herodotus, to name but a few. Turn your back on poetry, music, theatre and all of the arts. Bring a total end to logic, rationale, debate and connection. Annihilate where possible freedom of speech and cancel critical thinking. Delete all the mythical and historical heroes. Change your culture. Change the name of history. Change the names of your universities. Change the way you write. Um, and delete philosophy. Delete, delete, delete. And try thinking and living with a different language. You say it is impossible. 
and you are quite correct as you will not be able to complete a single sentence should you do this. It is simply impossible to delete or cancel Greece, the Greek, their role and their positive influence on this planet. Everything but everything is infused in some way, shape or form with the gift of Greekness, the gift that keeps on giving and wants nothing in return because it is an expression of philotimo. As my late uncle George would always say, the Greeks have given more to the world than what the world could ever hope to repay. This beautiful poem that I stumbled across was written by a lady named Dora Spiropoulou from Piraeus in Greece. A wonderful dedication to the, Green, the, the Hellenes and the Greeks, not only from Greece, but from all over the world. The Greeks of the mighty Diaspora and the Greeks of mainland Greece. I wish to, uh, to, to thank her for her beautiful words and to wish all of us happy Independence Day. Zito Eleftheria, Zito Yelada, Zito Ola Kiorea. So thank you for taking some time to listen to me on this special day and uh, may the gift of Hellenism continue to reign unabated throughout the world so that our children and our children's children can live in a free world to express themselves in whichever way they wish and not to be intimidated or to feel uncomfortable for being who they are and to express their individuality and to glorify God and his greatness. Take care, yasas, and bye for now. From Jim, here in Sydney, Martin Place, Australia, 25th of March, 2023.